Hello everyone and welcome to a short Star Wars Roll the Public video and in this video I will be buying the single rarest item in the game right now. Recently I did end up hitting credit cap which has motivated me to spend credits like I never would have before and one of the items that I have always wanted in the game but just never got in my hands on has been the Churka Kratomatic. Now this is officially the rarest item in the game. It is used solely for vanity sake so it really serves actually no purpose. Uh, all it does is that it disguises you as a box for a few seconds. Now initially considering this item's rarity, I thought it would be a lot cooler like maybe it had no cooldown and you were able to stay disguised for as long as you want but after buying the item I found out very quickly that it does have those limitations. It has a 1 minute cooldown and you only disguise for like 30 seconds or something. Now it is very similar to the hollow tree disguise that I'm also showing you right now in this video except it is like a million times more rare. And the reason this thing is so rare and why I label it as the rarest item in the game, uh, you know, even more rare than Platinum Sabers or Re Revan's Armor Set and stuff, is because it is simply not obtainable anywhere right now. You cannot get it from the cartel market or cartel packs. You cannot buy it from a vendor. Of course, you can buy it for the insane prices on the GTN, which you'll see me do uh, later on in this video. But the bottom line is that back in the day, many years ago, there was no official way to get this and so there's no official way to get this now. There were rumors that it dropped from random mobs on Corellia, which I think that was the case, but it was confirmed that the item was an extremely rare drop from artifact loot boxes that were available for commendations from a vendor on Corellia as well. Uh, Corellia used to be the highest level planet you could get to back in the day and when this thing was still in circulation. Nowadays, I'm not even sure if you can get it uh, anywhere. But even to this day, there are only very, very few of these crates available. And this item is so rare that when you use it, Bioware actually gives you an achievement. So it is officially recognized at like Bioware's level as an extremely rare item in the game. Uh, the achievement itself is called Those Things Exist. And the description states that somehow you were able to get a hold of a Churka Kratomatic. So even Bioware is saying like, how the hell did you do that? Uh, which is only testament to its extreme and unique rarity. Now the beauty of the Churka Kratomatic is that it is never bound to you no matter how many times you use it. So basically, I think what a lot of people do is they'll buy it and then they'll use it just for the achievement and then try to sell it later. It is the only item in the game though that when you use it, you can use it for however long you want and then sell it or trade it away later when you're done with it. So you can use it as much as you want. With every other item, if you use it, it is bound to you forever, meaning you can never sell it or give it away. Now this makes sense though, because the item itself is so rare that if, if it became bound to you when you used it, then there would literally be none in the game and only a handful of people will have ever had a chance to uh, get the achievement and to basically have fun with it and use it. Now I decided to pay the 70 something million credits for this item because as I said I have a credit cap and I'm being a lot more liberal with my credits now and I do remember like a few months back after I first started playing this game that I actually tried farming for this item like I tried hardcore I really really wanted it I opened those artifact loot boxes that I talked about earlier you had to pay a ton of commendations to get just one box and then you probably had like a 0.00001% chance of actually getting the item. And I remember wanting it so badly and now it's almost unreal that I actually get to have one. I'm also thinking about maybe some creative way of trying to pass it on to you guys so you can use it as like the achievement and then give it back. I'm, I don't know how that would work but I'm just thinking like you know such a cool item why not uh, share the wealth considering that it never gets bound to you as well. So I'll try to think of something like that but nonetheless I do hope you guys enjoyed this really short video. I just kind of wanted to showcase this item maybe give you guys some nostalgia for those of you players who've been playing for a very long time you might remember this item. It was like really like the rarest thing you could possibly get. It was really exciting when you got one. I think only like maybe 10, 20 players have ever actually uh, had it back in the day. I'm not sure how many people have it now, but it's really cool that uh, it's just unreal that I actually get to use one. And so you'll probably see me using it in like a lot of my videos. Anyways, I do hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you in the next one.